walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. Alright then, this is Tapeworm on the MTX512 because everyone wants to play with a tapeworm, don't they? Yeah. So it's kind of like, I didn't tell it to do that. Basically, don't eat your own ass. I wish someone would tell that to our dog, or dogs. It's Bailey. Bailey is a butt munch. Though he doesn't have tapeworm. Uh, no, I'm telling it to go down. Stupid tapeworm. And normally they're such intelligent creatures. Sitting around in people's guts eating food that doesn't belong to them. Let's have some cherries because tapeworm like cherries. And it takes them a long while to eat it and makes them make strange noises. You. God. Yeah. One minute, fifteen seconds. I've only got like, I've got two minutes and fifty-one left. I don't even want to try again, but I can't just leave the video at one minute twenty-five, can I? I want to, but I think it would be wrong. Uh, And this is supposed to be fun. Why? You kind of have to tell it which direction to go in before it gets there. Because if you do it at exactly the time you think you should have, he just runs into the wall. There, like that. One life less. Watch out. Well, do you think it being a tapeworm, you'd want to kill it? I want to kill it. Yeah, that's how to do it. Don't get worming pills, just smack it in the head with a brick. Had enough now. Yes. Tapeworm. Memotech. MTX512. Don't bother. Thank you for watching. Here we go then, Super Minefield by Continental Software on the Memotech MTX512. What is super about a minefield? You walk into it and it blows your legs off. They have some funny ideas about what's fun and it's not working. <laughs>